New this morning, a disease affecting deer is spreading across the country, and some are concerned it might affect humans. CBS 42 News reporter Connie Gasquey live in studio with details on the condition that's being called zombie deer disease. Con. Well, guys, the disease affects a deer's brain and causes erratic behavior. That's where the nickname comes from. And some people are even comparing it now to mad cow disease. I spoke to a wildlife official about it. She says it is part of the same family of diseases as mad cow disease, but this disease has not spread to humans yet. CDC leaders hope to keep it that way, and wildlife leaders here in Alabama hope to prevent it from even spreading to deer in our state. It's important for folks to know that in addition to monitoring the deer herd that we have currently in Alabama, the Wildlife and Freshwater Fisheries Division is taking active measures to try to keep infected deer and deer carcasses out of this state. She says they've been testing deer for this disease since 2002. They've tested more than 8,000 altogether. They found zero cases in the state of Alabama. And they say if you see any deer exhibiting unusual behavior, you should report it to DCNR so they can have those deer tested. Guys, back to you.